Hi guys, Aviation JFK here, back at you with another video. Today we're going to be doing the 22nd airport update of my 1 to 400 scale JFK model airport. Now I just want to take a moment to apologize for the fact that I did not upload an airport update in the past two weeks. That was a combination of me being sick and me being out of town. Um, but yeah, I'm back for a bit now, um, before I go on holiday again in a few weeks. Um, but yeah, the first comment shout out goes to Aviation in Vegas. He was the first person to comment on last airport update, so thus he wins a shout out. If you want to be part of that, just be the first person to comment on this video and I'll shout you out in the next one. And without any further ado, let's just get straight into this video. So the time frame for this update is roughly around 9.30pm. So most of the heavy departures have left already, um, but there are still quite a few still lingering around the airport. Um, and many of the short haul flights are already hunkering down for the night waiting and preparing for early morning departures. So first up here we have a Jet Airways Airbus A340-300. This aircraft touched down in from Mumbai two and a half hours ago and is set to head back out to Mumbai in roughly an hour and a half time. As you can see there's some GSC at the aircraft just servicing the aircraft. Um, there's cleaners on board as well just preparing the aircraft for the new passengers who are set to come on board. And then right here we have this KLM 787-9 which is just preparing for flight back out to Amsterdam. This aircraft touched down in roughly around 2 hours ago and is set to head back out to Amsterdam in an hour and a half time. A lot of the new bags are being loaded on, the cleaners are still on board and the passengers are just about to start boarding this wide body aircraft for its return flight back out to Amsterdam. And then right here we have this British Airways 777-200ER which was set to head back out to London Heathrow roughly around two hours ago. This aircraft was found to have an APU problem when the passengers were all on board and all the bags were loaded on. So now all the passengers have been deboarded and have been set onto a different flight two hours later than they should have been departing. Which is sad so this aircraft will be heading out to London Heathrow tomorrow at 2pm once the problem has been resolved. And then right here we have this Virgin Atlantic Airbus A350-1000. Now this aircraft is running very full tonight as a lot of the British Airways passengers were loaded onto this flight for, for a return out to London Heathrow. Now this aircraft came in roughly around two hours ago and is set to head back out in roughly around an hour and a half time. As you can see the aircraft is just being refueled and some of the passengers have just started boarding um, for its return flight back out to London Heathrow. And then right here, a new face at the airport, we have this Singapore Airlines Airbus A380-800. As you can see, this aircraft is just being pushed back for a flight out to Frankfurt, which will then be continuing on to Singapore. Now the non-stop service, if you did not know, runs from Newark um, on an Airbus A350-900, and this is, you could say, the cheaper option for passengers wanting to travel to Singapore. This aircraft arrived in from Singapore or Frankfurt, roughly around four hours ago and is set to make a departure in roughly around five minutes time after it's made its way towards the runway. And then right here moving on to the Delta terminal we have this Delta 717 which is just prepared for the night here at JFK. This aircraft came in from Tampa earlier today at roughly around 4 p.m then went into maintenance and is now pretty much ready for a flight tomorrow morning back out to Tampa. And then right here we have this Delta 737-800 which is just refueling for a flight back out to Cleveland. That is also exactly where it came in from roughly around an hour and a half ago um, and this aircraft is set to head out in roughly around 20 minutes once all the passengers and bags are loaded on. And then right here we have this Delta Airbus A330-300 which touched down in from Rome roughly around 4 hours ago. Now this aircraft is pretty much ready for its return flight back out to Rome in roughly around 30 minutes time. The passengers are well underway now on boarding the aircraft. The last bags have just been loaded on as you can see by one of the empty baggage loaders um, and the cleaning bus has just also arrived to pick up the cleaners. Now as you can see the aircraft is also being refueled for its return flight back out to Rome. And then right here we have this Delta CRJ 700 which is just rounding off for the day after a flight in from Toronto. Now this aircraft is just deboarding some of its passengers 
all the cargo has already been loaded off um, but there was an issue with the jet bridge hence why there were still passengers deboarding um, so yeah this aircraft actually does not have a scheduled flight out tomorrow morning yet um, but there will be one as of midnight tonight and then right here we have another Delta CRJ 700 which is just preparing for a flight out to Boston now this aircraft came in from Raleigh Durham roughly around 15 minutes ago um, and is set to head out to Boston in roughly around 30 minutes time as you can see the aircraft is being refueled and the baggage are being loaded for the return flight out to Boston and then right here we have this UPS MD-11 which is just waiting for a pushback truck to push it back for its flight out to Louisville. Now this aircraft came in from Louisville roughly around 6 hours ago um, and is set to head back out to Louisville in roughly around 10 minutes time. As you can see all the GSC has moved to the side um, and the aircraft is fully prepared for the flight back out to Louisville. And then right here we have this American Airlines 757-200 which has just touched down in from Charlotte. Now this aircraft will be heading back out to Charlotte tomorrow morning at 6am which is a pretty early morning departure um, for this aircraft. Um, but yeah it's just taxiing towards the American Airlines terminal before it stays the night and heads back out to Charlotte in the morning. And then right here, just taxiing towards its terminal, we have this Alaska Airlines 737-800, which has just touched down in from Seattle. Now this aircraft, unlike the 757 behind it, will not be staying the night um, and will be returning to Seattle in roughly around an hour and a half time. And then right here for the very final aircraft of this airport update, we have this Cathay Pacific 777-300ER in the beautiful One World livery. Now this aircraft, as you can see, has just exited the runway and is going to be making its way over to Terminal 1 where it will be staying the night before heading back out to Hong Kong in roughly around 9 hours time. So yeah, that's basically it for this airport update. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, again, I just want to apologise for the fact that I did not upload these two or two of these in the last week, last few weeks. Um, but yeah, there will be more uploads coming now. Um, and yeah, if you made it to the end of this video, please consider subscribing because we're really close to 500 subscribers. Um, and it would mean a lot to me if we could hit that by the end of July. So yeah, it's been Aviation JFK, signing off.